Look at this video in Cape Coral from last night. That is a teen trying to get away from troopers along Veterans Parkway and Del Prado Boulevard. NBC2's Rachel Whalen is in Cape Coral showing you how state troopers managed to stop this dangerous driver from doing any real damage. Florida Highway Patrol says they had to perform a pit maneuver to finally arrest the suspect. That was done here on Del Prado and Veterans, right between the Master Crab Restaurant and the Remax. They say they chased her all over Cape Coral for around 10 minutes, and she reached speeds as high as 100 miles per hour. New dash camera video shows troopers chasing a silver Dodge Charger on Veterans Parkway. David Tindall witnessed the action around nine last night. Next thing I know, there's FHP doing a pit maneuver on a Dodge Charger. I'm like, whoa, okay. This came out of nowhere. That pit maneuver helped troopers arrest 18 year old Aliyah de Kaiser. Troopers say they originally tried to pull her over for a traffic stop, but things escalated quickly when de Kaiser turned off her lights and hit the gas. And the vehicle was running red lights and, and putting the public in danger at one point on Chiquita Boulevard was even going the wrong way. Um, all of that behavior is extremely dangerous and, and obviously is not going to be tolerated. When troopers finally put her in handcuffs, they found drugs and $5,000 of cash in her car. At the end of the day, we're trying to prevent loss of life, prevent injuries, prevent property damage. Last year, we had an upwards of 3,500 3, lives lost in our roadways. And that's something that should be concerning to all of us. I just don't run from the cops. <laughs> Simple. DeKaiser is now facing felony charges for running from police and drug possession. I'm reporting in Southeast Cape Coral, Rachel Whalen, NBC2.